Hello friends, in this video I will give you some information about robotics and automation. Robotics and Automation Contents Introduction Mechatronics What is Robotics? Laws of Robotics Automation Automation versus Robotics Benefits of Robotics Process Automation Why Robotics Process Automation Types of Robots Stationary Industrial Robots Main Parts of Industrial Robots Industrial Applications Today's robots, future of robots, advantage and disadvantage, conclusion, introduction, automation and robotics are two closely related technologies. Automation is a technology concerned with mechatronics and the operation and control of production. Robotics is a form of industrial automation. Mechatronics, mechatronics equals mechanics plus electronics plus computing. It includes a combination of mechanical engineering, electrical engineering, telecommunications engineering, control engineering, computer engineering, robotics. Simply it is machine that performs complicated tasks and is guided by automatic controls. Robotics involves the design, construction, and operation of a robot. Laws of robotics. A robot may not injure a human being or, through an action, allow a human being to come to harm. A robot must obey orders given to it by human beings, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. A robot must protect its own existence as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Automation Automation involves a mechanical device that can imitate the actions of people or animals. By combining robot with automation, we can achieve automated robot. Automation vs Robotics Automation machinery designed to carry out a specific task. Bottling machine Dishwasher Paint sprayer Robots machinery designed to carry out a variety of tasks, pick and place arms, mobile robots, computer numerical control machines. Benefits of robotics process automation, cost savings and consistently high performance, accuracy, scalability, analytics, types of robots, mobile robots, used for search area remotely these are, rolling robots, used for search area in flat area, walking robots, insects and crawfish. Stationary robots, used in industries, it's programmable. Autonomous robots, it's a own brain or self-supporting. Remote control robots, used as remote control robot. Beam robots, it's used as biological traits. Virtual robots, it is imaginary. It's a program's building blocks of software inside a computer. Stationary industrial robots, definition, an automatically controlled, reprogrammable, multipurpose, manipulate a programmable in three or more axes, which may be either fixed in place, or mobile for use in industrial automation applications. Main parts of industrial robots. Controller. It's regulate the whole parts to keep them working together. Arm. It's a mechanical part that is connected to the end effector and sensor to complete a specific work. Drive. The links are moved to desired position by the drive. It may be by hydraulic pressure or by electricity. End effector. It's an end part of the arm, also called as hand. It may be gripper, vacuum pump, welder, spry gun, etc. Sensor. It gives the information or electronic signal to the controller about its surrounding and introduce the exact position of the arm. Main parts of industrial robots. These are the parts shown in the figure. Industrial application. Manipulation for pick and place. Assembly. Spray painting and coating. Arc welding. Spot welding with pneumatic or servo control gun, laser cutting and welding, gluing and sealing, mechanical finishing operations, debarring, grinding. Today's robots, tasks which are dangerous, boring or repetitive, high precision or high speed, explore, space, underwater, military. Military robots are autonomous robots or remote control device designed for military applications. Household robots, vacuum, molon, clean. Future of robots, man is working nowadays, but today as far as our imagination has reached, we have made robotics which are used for work and entertainment purposes. To make our lives more easy, we have to modify robots. In future robots will take a higher position in human society. The idea of robots becoming smarter and overcoming humans explored in many movies. Advantage, greater flexibility, reprogrammability, kinematics dexterity greater response time to inputs than humans, improve product quality, maximize capital intensive equipment in multiple work shifts, accident reduction, 
reduction of hazardous exposure for human workers, automation less susceptible to work stoppages, disadvantage, replacement of human labor, greater unemployment, significant retraining costs for both unemployed and users of new technology, hidden costs, conclusion. Today we find most robots working for people in industries, factories, warehouses, and laboratories. Robots are useful in many ways. For instance, it boosts economy because businesses need to be efficient to keep up with the industry competition. Therefore, having robots helps business owners to be competitive because robots can do jobs better and faster than humans. Thank you.